What is up, heroes? This is Midnight Zero, and welcome back to Let's Play Super Mario Odyssey Blind. Again, thank you to the patrons for choosing this as a patron pick. You'll notice that I'm recording these in bulk, and that's because the patrons have built up quite a few uh, patron pick videos just over the past couple months, and this was decided upon as one of their options that they'd like to see quite a bit of. So, well, here we are. And honestly, I'm totally down for it because this has been a lot of fun to play. Also, interesting, everything's quite a bit different. I didn't think so, but I figured I'd give it a go. So we've got these tanks. The question is, why? <laughs> Oof, that uh, didn't turn out so well. Sorry about that, Mario, that probably hurt. Oh, I tried to get a double there. There we go. So yeah, we've got these tanks to deal with. Honestly, I'd rather deal with them than, you know, the rest of the friends. But actually, we can just go a lot quicker by uh, traveling this way, can't we? We're looking for the secret, right? That's where we're looking to go. Oh, can we not warp again? I'm a little bit confused, but... Nevertheless... We'll persevere. Oh, and all of those aren't even moving anymore. It's certainly a different level. Aw, oh, man. Alright, well, we'll... Can I... There we go. All the way up there. We get a second shot at this, guys. Let's not screw it up, right? Dang. Now we get to deal with that lovely music the entirety of the time. Alright, um, we'll go up here. And again. Aw, oh, really? There we go. I probably should have gone and gotten that just for the sake of the health up, but that's okay. Ooh, what is... What is this? We absolutely can use that to launch ourselves, but why in the world did I want to do that? Really? Uh, I wish I would have had some means of determining where I launched to, or at least know where I was going to launch to prior to being launched. So now we're just gonna have to go back up that way. Anything to say? The entrance to the secret flower field is that way. Okay, so I guess we shouldn't even be concerning ourselves with over here. I guess we can maybe take over these guys? We can! Nice! So we can... Oh, we can aim like that. Interesting. We'll take you out too. And can we head in? No, I didn't think so. Pull the lever to receive a seed. Okay. I require time to prepare the next seed. Alright, I guess we can put it there and hope for the best. Wow. That is some fertile soil. <laughs> can I climb this? Oh, I can. Well, then climb it we will. Am I expected to jump off of this over there? Yes. It seems so. Sorry, we're just going to climb up. Or is there some other way to get over there? Hmm. I'm not seeing one, at the very least. But I also don't foresee being able to do it. I, I feel like I need to be... one of those little plant guys in order to get those. So for the time being, we'll just carry on. Whoa. 
That was not the direction I wanted to move in at all. Okay, what is going on over there, guys? The recharge station is crowded, so it seems. Patience expiring, initiating passive-aggressive commentary. <laughs> really, a moon. Thanks for the charge. Yeah, I mean, I guess we'll take those. Oh, we only have three in this version of the world, I guess. Anything up there? Oh, there is something up there. I don't know how to get there, though, but that's all right. Again, I feel like it'll have to be... Can I take over these guys? No, I can't. My bad. He apparently did not make it to the charge station in time. Hmm. Could try to stack a nice tower of Goombas. Is that going to be enough, though? Probably not. What is up with that Goomba? I'm curious. Is it going to fire arrows at me or something, or what? I am very intrigued. Come on over here, buddy. Nice. Can we jump on top of you? Oh, well we can. We can get hurt in the process, obviously. But we can! There we go. Oh, so we don't even have to fall on top of them, we can just jump on top. That's good to know. Okay, so now that we have accumulated all of this tower, let's head on over here. I feel like I could also fall down there and potentially get that. What is up with this rocket, though? I'm too curious not to. Old B to launch. Okay. I don't know why I'm launching it or what I'm launching to, but w I guess we'll launch it. Is this like a secret? Interesting. This reminds me of like some sort of secret level. This is pretty cool. I'm digging it. So we gotta find five of the moon shards you know, amongst this fog. Dang, it definitely restricts visibility. Obviously we're in the clouds, uh, so that explains it all, I guess. Oh, we have flying Goombas. Can I fly? I can. Let's go back and get some of these coins. Ooh. We can go down a little bit more. Interesting. So when I shape the, sh the, the Joy-Cons, I get quite a bit more boost. I guess we can fly over this way, too. Make a huge difference. And this is where we just were. From here, where do I go? We're missing one. Doesn't look like it's over there. Is it over this way, maybe? Pretty sure this is where we just came up, right? Maybe we have to knock out one of the, uh... Oh, is it down here? I thought I saw something moving. Oh, what's going on down here? Oh man, I don't want to have to give this up. Alright, well, regardless, we have one available there. Oh, so there's a moon hidden in here. And I think that's going to be separate from the one that's related to all the different moon shards we're looking for. That I don't know how I'm going to find. Because we're only looking for one more. Why can I not go up anymore? Huh? Is there something I'm missing? Why can I not go up any higher? That's very strange. Why can't I go any higher? That's so weird. I feel like I should be able to, right? This right, I'm not even. I'm gonna have to like go back to the beginning of the level without any of these flying Goombas. That was very strange. I don't know why that was the case, but but it was. So we made do. <laughs> Is it in there? Nope. Doesn't seem so. 
steal one of you guys. Is it over this way? No. Okay. We can go this way. But then from here, where? This is obviously towards the beginning again. Oh, it's so tough to see. Anything over here? No. Let's see here. Let's let's retrace our steps a little bit. I wanted to see if there was anything further down here. There's something. Ah, there we go. Underneath. How interesting. That's pretty cool. Wait, what? Well, I was like, why am I not able to go any higher? Man, these, these Goombas are something up with my Joy-Cons. It's probably my Joy-Cons. Cool. So now we have all of the um, Power Moons from here. And I guess I can just leave? I was going to say, I don't know how this works if we launch straight up again, but it seems we launch back down to where we started. Am I going to have to recreate my Goomba Tower? I think so. Yeah, it looks like it. That's okay, though. It was pretty fun, honestly. Thank you. Haha. -ha. We have commandeered the Goomba. Oh, darn it. That was... All according to plan. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. I need to... I need to jump on this guy sooner than later. There we go. Now we are good to go. Uh, wow, this Goomba is all over us now that we're at this huge tower. Loving the forest runes. That's funny. Oh, is that... Did we get... We're, did we get secret moons earlier? Is that what was going on? I don't know. Regardless, I actually want to... Now that I've done that go down here, this vine area, and see if I can get those bolts. So away we go! And we're living. I believe this is how we're gonna get him. Nice. Cool. I should have ground pounded while I was up there. Let's see if we can bring him over here. Come on. Alright, we'll go up. Up, 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 and... Let's see here. Jump and ground pound. Nice. That was satisfying. <laughs> I'm a big fan of that. And look at that. We have 840 coins. That's a lot of coins. Mario, how are you How are you climbing? I can't say I've seen that technique before. All of these guys are back again, but we no longer care. So we continue onwards. Got a tank. Blowing stuff up. We got a few tanks blowing stuff up. Anything back here of use? Ooh, we got these guys. Forty-seven, which is about what we had before in the previous Sand Kingdom. Let's take a look here. Ooh, there's an area over there I potentially want to go to. Oh, they can aim upwards. Dang, I did not realize that. So how do I want to get them to aim, right? I clearly need to build a path. Eh, we'll figure it out. Honestly, I don't think I can really go wrong. We can take care of the other ones by doing something like that. Oh, and I see some of the bolts off in the distance. How are we going to be able to get those guys? Ah, I see. How are we going to be able to get over there? Okay, I, I, I can see it. So we'll start busting away. I wouldn't be surprised if there was a power moon hidden in here somewhere or something like that. Not there? Oh, I'm surprised. I mean, if we get rid of all of it, we should be good to go. We should still have a staircase. What I'm most concerned about is whether or not there's something like up here 
that should we get rid of all of the breakable stuff, we not be able to get... Ooh, is that a moon? It looks like a moon. Why are we not able to see so many of these moons? Why is it telling us there are only like three in the area, and we've already gotten four? And we're probably going to get a couple more. Interesting. Alright, I think we're good at that. Okay, we can go here, here, etc. Oh, what? Can I not climb on top of this? Okay, no, I can. Behind the rock wall, we've obtained a moon. There we go. Let's activate this while we can. Summit path. We've still got quite a bit to go up there. Not to mention that area over to the left that we saw. Right? Now we've... Oh, we got 50. Cool. About halfway. Well, not exactly halfway, actually. I want to see... Can I get over there? I mean, I definitely can. I can jump over. The question is, can I come back? And can I do so easily? <laughs> right? Ooh, I mean, we'll take those for the coins, right? It's five coins. All right, that's something. What are you doing over here? You look like you're having a good time. If that slope is too steep for you. Try enhancing your foot speed with a flower. Okay. Let's take a look. Oh, so we're almost there. Well, the thing is, I want to check out the. I want to check out the other area. Ooh, what's that? There's a moon up there. How do I get up there? How do I get up there? I feel like I need to take this plant guy. No. Hmm. We'll take a look. Because that's certainly something. I'm curious. The other question is, what do we do over here? Because there's certainly something. There's a little path going over there. I'm too curious. Oh, we can go there from the very beginning. Okay, that's good. That's good to know. It's not exclusive to starting here. Cool. Alright, then we should be good. Uh, oh, and there's stuff up there, though, too. How are we going to get up there? Well, we'll explore. We'll explore. Alright. Whoa. That was fast. It's good to know that we can do this now. Oh man. Okay, so clearly I need to uh, go up to the right. Do I take fall damage? I don't know. I thought it would be on some sort of timer, more so than whether or not we run into something. But, here we are. Got a little challenge, or secret area, or whatever it may be. We're playing tanks. We gotta destroy this, presumably. Using our tank friend. And then what? Anything else of interest? What's that up there? Doesn't seem too interesting. Regardless, we'll go over here and do that so that when it does boot up, it's not exactly able to find us very easily. Whoa! Okay! I guess that works. Oh, hello there! Can I do the spinny thing? Let me throw my hat around. Oh, come on. Regardless, I guess we can just do this and uh, make our lives a bit easier. Got ourselves another P block. I wonder. Oh, I want. I bet we could have run over those. Can we stand on the P block? We can. That's really funny. Interesting. Okay, so we obviously got a lot more to deal with this time around. A lot of fireballs. We'll do that before anything else. Um, darn, just a little bit high there. And again. Oof. Did I get one of them, though? Really? really thought I'd get one of them. Alright. There we go. There's one. That was a little bit low. That should do it. Oh, no, did I hit the fireball? That's probably what happened that one time. 
Okay, so we got that guy. And then lastly, certainly not least, that guy. And we should get some coins for that. Now, I actually need to be careful not to hit the P-block just yet. Because I need to get up here. Can I wall jump? Yeah. Okay. And then... I can't... I can't see, man. <laughs> oh, wait, no. Alright, we can do this. And we should be good. I love this remix of the underground theme. We're also almost at a... Uh, whoa. We're almost at a thousand... Yeah, we're almost at a thousand coins, which is monumental because we'll get the boxers. It, it's interesting that it allows for both Joy-Con and right stick movement at the same time. I would think that they would disable one or the other, or they'd force you to choose. Alright, so we got rid of all of those guys. Anything else I need to get while I'm here? Doesn't seem so. I guess I could clear my own path like this. There's probably a cage behind here. Yeah. Oh, with a moon. Alright, I mean, works for me. And there we are with our, like, sixth moon, despite it showing three at the beginning. Alright, out we go. That was a fun little side tour. I can appreciate that. I don't think there's anything else to be gained from going up that again, besides coins up, obviously. Interesting. Well, we'll, we'll flag that, for completeness sake. Ooh, there's that area up there I haven't been to. There's all of this, all of this platforming to do, I want to. I want to see what's up there. I don't see any way to get up there, though. Hmm. I don't know. I'm curious. Let's check out this area, obviously. I can always, like, break these, I guess? Or not, I mean... I'm sure there are platforms for something. I just ruined my shot of getting access to some area of the level, or not. Maybe something is actually hidden in here. Like that. Is there anything else to get here, though, while I'm uh, still this little sprout thingy? Doesn't seem so. So, I guess we'll, we'll head to the 2D arena. Looks pretty straightforward. Got some Goombas ahead. I love the 8-bit forms of all the songs. Ooh, there's a moon. I timed that jump poorly, but that's okay. And... Aw, oh, almost. Yeah, I'm not gonna be able to get it that way. I didn't think so. But I figured I'd try just to be safe. There we go. Cool. Out we go. And we come out up here. Dang, that's a that's a useful shortcut. I feel like Oh man, I'm so tempted to go down there. I'm so tempted. I'm so tempted. We're going to do it. Might not have been the best decision, but we'll um we'll see. No, did I miss? No, I didn't. Okay, Whew. that could have been bad. What is over this way? A warp pipe. Am I supposed to start on this side, or I mean, I mean we'll find out, right? 
Oh, no! I wanted a long jump, for the record. It was supposed to be a long jump, but it came out as just a normal jump. Oh, and it's gonna start us here. Gotta do so much work to get over there. Or, no, or maybe not. Maybe the platform series is actually over here. And I just need to find it. Interesting. Found a little, little peach there. What's going on over here? Oh, we got another one of those rooms? That's where the platforming is. I guess we can give it a go. Oops. Just practicing for the next time I actually have to do it and I die if I miss it up. <laughs> Ooh, I'm digging the remix already. Alright, P-Switch, show me the way. Got plenty of Goombas. Okay. Okay. Plenty of Goombas. Plenty of Goombas. Um... Where did it go? Oh, it went back there, I see. I think I was supposed to stack the Goombas so I could get up there. I think that was the intent there. I'm actually gonna try that. Sorry, Mario. We're so close to a thousand coins, but I just can't, can't not go for that secret. Because I'm pretty sure that's what we're supposed to do. Like, fairly confident. Okay. There we go. Nice. Flower Road Reach. We also definitely have the required number of moons to continue our travels. I think we only needed three more, and we've got, what, like, almost ten? Whoa. Whoa. That was not what I, uh, foresaw. Oh, I can wall jump with it. Oh, you bet we're going the, to get these. This is neat. Okay. So we can go over here. Ah, missed that one coin. Forever haunt me. Oh, I didn't even realize I could do that. Alright, Mar Mario, it's time to, time to get back on the path. Cool. Got ourselves another moon. Flower Road Run. And with that, I guess we can move on. 989 coins. Now, where do we come out? Oh, just here. So, I feel like that warp pipe is actually the end of the, the platforming. So the question becomes, is it worth it, right? Is it really worth it? I'm too curious not to. That's like what it really comes down to. What is it? Oh, oh darn it. That was not what I wanted to happen. But somehow we ended up here. <laughs> Pro strats. <laughs> do we just skip all of that? Do we just skip all of that platforming? Did we just do that? Did we seriously just do that? <laughs> we totally did. Wow. I really think that that just happened. Oh, but I'm all the way back here. Oh. I would have gotten that by platforming around here, I think. Okay, so different. We skipped different platforming. Alright, alright. We're gonna take care of you guys first. And then we'll we'll do this. Bit just make it a bit quicker. No need to be super complete. Just complete enough. Alright, that should be good. No! Oh, that's not what I wanted. Don't like... 
don't cling to the wall. Just, just. <laughs> Mario, you're killing me, man. All right. Hmm. Okay, so now that we're up here again, I think I'm gonna try and do the, uh, what's it called? This thing again? Because that's where I came out up all the way up there, right? Is there a better way to get up there? Is there another way? Maybe. But maybe not. There's gotta be, actually no, we're not doing this again. <laughs> that was a really long, that was a really long side room or whatever. I also don't think that was even necessarily the one. I think the one we actually did was over here. <laughs> what a sound effect. Anything missed by going there? No. We can check out what's over here. This is that platforming. Oops, that I accidentally just started. Where does it go? No, no, no! Joy-Cons! Joy-Cons. I didn't want to keep going. We're gonna get a moon. Just out of sheer luck. But I swear, I did not w I stopped moving because I did not want to keep moving. Are you really right up there right now? Can you, can you jump? Grab the ledge, Mario. Alright, so I mean, we'll make do with what we have, I guess. We can grab these guys. Um, can I not jump up there? I probably have to use this guy. Which is fine. It's not what I expected. And then what about, like, this elevator? What do I do for that? those coins there. This is back towards the beginning of the level. There's obviously all of those guys over there. But how do I get over there? I don't know. I don't know. I'm at a bit of a loss. Oh, I thought I'd jump on him. But I did not. So from up here, can I can I jump higher up or what? Or am I stuck? Do I really have to go back from the beginning of the level again? Actually, you know what? I don't. And you know why? It's because I can teleport, right? I should be able to just do this. And what a life send. I'm really glad that we can do that. Alright, let's try this again. Man, I'm sorry this is, this is taking so long. Alright, through here. Back through here. This segment at least did not take very long. It was relatively painless too, right? There are a couple Goombas, but aside from that, you know, no, there's probably not going to be a lot killing us here. Honestly, I think I like the the 8-bit version of this better than the original. Okay, let's try this again. So we'll we'll come down here, nice and slowly. Let's let's get a little bit of a game plan going. So I definitely need to long jump while they're kind of angled upwards. And for that, I'm going to need my controller to long jump when I want it to. And long jump. Okay. Oh, no. Oh, no. <sighs> it's going to take so long to get back here. Hmm. So obviously I didn't quite have it right. But again, 
it seems relatively painless to get back there. I'm sure you guys will eventually start to get frustrated with me, but bear with me. <laughs> Please. I swear I'm trying. We're getting plenty of coins. Certainly making up for the ten. Also, I don't know if you guys can hear that. That's my dog snoring in the background. She's, uh, 14. I have two dogs. Lacey and Bailey. One of them is three, and one of them is 14. Alright, let's try this again. For what it's worth, I haven't really been using a lot of the hat-specific features for the platforming, I feel. Okay, so what do I need to do? When it's angled like that, I need to jump across... Hmm... No... Let's see here. So if I jump right about now, I should be okay. I need to jump on this, and then long jump, and we made it across. Nice. Don't don't die now, Mario. <laughs> don't die now. Oh wow, and lots of coins and a moon. Cool. I actually spinning platforms treasure. I really like this room. I love the aesthetic of it. It reminds me a lot of Donkey Kong Country. Getting all the coins. And now we can finally move on. Sorry for dragging you guys through that for, well, the entirety of the time I dragged you through it. Did I accidentally have one of them kill the other? That's actually kind of funny. Anything of interest up here? No, doesn't seem so. It's also really tough to tell with the camera like that. Oh, really? How do I get up there? How do I get up there? Alright, well, regardless... Do I actually need to, uh... Be one of the tanks up here? Or no? I think so. To hit these things? Yeah, I think so. Not too surprised. This kind of reminds me of, like, Space Invaders, the whole barriers set up and firing from the back. Alright, take you out, take you out. Can... Joy-Con. <laughs> Killing me, man. Joy-Con, stop! The thing is, I, I don't even use my Joy-Cons that much. I really don't. Okay, that's one. Joy-Con, I don't want to go forward that much. Alright, we'll take that, and then lastly, that one. And with that, we should be good to go. Cool, got ourselves a moon, and this is another checkpoint. Path to the secret flower field. Dang, took almost like 40 minutes to, to get here. We got a lot of moons along the way, so definitely worth it. And the path finally opens. Defend the secret flower field? From what? From what? Am I gonna need a flower to get up the slope? Ready? I mean... I guess so. Here we go! What battle lies in store? Oh, dang, this... Is so cool looking. Oh wow, this is what they're using to steal all of the the flowers and everything. Can I do something with that, or do I do I go and get sucked into it, stop it up? <laughs> I feel like we just made it very mad. Or do we really finish it with that? Flowers, 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 must have all the flowers. <laughs> oh, those little antenna things are like eyes, I think. Do not mess with me, biped. <laughs> Alright, so now we have started the boss fight. This is a cool looking boss. So it's got a force field, and um, I presumably need to break some of these blocks with this. I don't know what these are, but we definitely need to break them. I think they're providing the, the the barrier. So once that's been done, I don't know, I can do that again. 
and that seems to do quite a bit of damage. So I guess we'll keep that up. All right. Is that gonna go outwards or? Oh, I was gonna say, can we hide up there? I love the sound effect these things make. They're so funny. Can I go up here? No, I can't. Darn. That's okay. Alright, up here we go. Oh, hello there. Aww, I thought it'd be pretty neat if I could, I don't know, get something crazy going on. And uh, jump on top of it. But I'm not surprised that the barrier hurt me. There's two. And then lastly, the one we tried to get first. Three. We go back underneath. Zap, 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 zap. <laughs> Yeah, I, I gotta figure out what the name of the, this enemy is, because it's easily one of the best. I love that little sound effect it makes. Little... Cool. <laughs> cool. And now four? Nope, just three. But they're, they've got more blocks around them. And because we've already started that, it's already doing that attack, which means it's going to be stationary, which means it's really just a sitting duck. And this will probably be the last hit, given Mario's pattern of, you know, third time's the charm when it comes to boss fights. And it looks like that was the case yet again. Ooh, and all the flowers are returning. Nice. Man, I love this environment. This place, this little dome, the secret flower field, is so beautiful. Look at this. It's gorgeous. I'm so, I'm, I'm so impressed. Regardless... Let's get this multi-moon and, and finish up the level. What's crazy is like, it's the same world we did before, but we were able to get so many more moons in so many different ways, just based on like, I don't know, the, the changing of the whole piranha plants to the tanks and everything. It's crazy. Okay, so now what? <laughs> Oh, we got a toad here. Interesting. What does toad have to say? Hi, Mario. To help out Princess Peach, I'm doing a survey of power moon locations. Having trouble finding power moons? I can help you out for 50 coins. Want to buy a hint? Nah, I'm good. <laughs> Alright, see you later. Interesting, that's good. I, I appreciate that that's like a way to, to help out people that are struggling to find them. Given there are so many of them, we have quite a few. Let's see where we're going next, because we definitely have more than the three necessary to fill up this part of the Odyssey. And this is resisting my collected, my like completionist tendencies to go back and complete each kingdom before moving on to the next one. Because in reality, that's probably what I would do. The Odyssey is powered up. Yes, it has. We've reached 53. It's a pretty cool number, if you ask me. Oh, we can get to the Lake Kingdom now. Maybe we'll catch up to Bowser there. Okay, so it doesn't really matter as far as what order we go. All right, and let's head to the Lake Kingdom. Fly on over. Again, the the artificial choice, right? You get to pick where you go. You get to explore what you want. You can go to the Wooded Kingdom or the Lake Kingdom. You choose. But you're going to be doing both anyways. You just choose which one you go to first. And you're immediately going to the other one afterwards. Understandable. I mean, it's not a bad thing. This is funny when you think about it. Alright, Cappy, what useful tip, what useful hint do you have for us this time? What are we going to be reviewing during our flight? To think, their precious Sore bouquet stolen. We can't let that Bowser keep doing whatever he wants. Seeing as how we've got some time to kill, let's review some useful skills. Travel tip, spin throw. When you're surrounded by enemies and just wish you could hit them all at once, snap the Joy-Con to the side to do a spin throw. Your hat will spin all around you. Ah, that's actually useful, because I've been struggling with that. Well, there it is. Next, let's read up on the Lake Kingdom. It says they're known for their fashion, and oh, there's a famous wedding gown there called the Lock Lady Dress. Oh, that's that's actually pretty great. Ooh, and it's kind of dark. Like nighttime. Flying around at night. Oh my goodness. This place looks beautiful. I literally say that about every environment we go to. Dang, it looks so nice. Look at that. Brutals over the lake. Ah, I see. But wow. <laughs> the Brutals, they're here too. Dang, look at how gorgeous this environment is. 
I'm so excited to explore it. But as you guys have probably anticipated, we're going to be exploring it in the next episode. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. We spent a lot of time in the Wooded Kingdom. I hope you guys didn't get frustrated with my platforming shenanigans. And, I don't know. I hope you're excited for this. I don't know how much more patron pick of this there will be. Maybe it'll become a series. It really depends on how much support outside of the patrons there is for something like this. I'm enjoying the game quite a bit. I am playing it a little bit differently than I normally would in that I would be more of a completionist in a typical run of a game like this. Uh, before moving on to future worlds, but maybe I'll have chill episodes where I go back and complete things. Who knows? Regardless, I'll see you guys in the next episode, if there is another episode. But until then, this is Movie Night Zero, and this mission is complete. <laughs>